The Northern Territory Police Association is calling on the government to urgently clarify the future of Police Commissioner Jamie Chalker. On Saturday, Sky News revealed the government had asked Mr Chalker to resign after losing confidence in him. Matt Cunningham broke that story. She jo he joins us live from Darwin now. Matt, what's been the response from government? It's kind of weird. Certainly is. I think it's more what they're not saying rather than what they are that is giving you an indication of what's going on here. But uh, as you were saying in your introduction, the Northern Territory Police Association calling on the government to come clean on exactly what is going on here. It is now more than three days since we first broke that news uh, that the government had asked Jamie Chalker to resign because it no longer had confidence in him. But uh, the government is still uh, putting out pretty bland statements simply saying that the Commissioner is on leave. Uh, but not saying any more. Natasha Files was asked 11 times during a press conference yesterday whether she had confidence in Jamie Chalker, whether she had asked him to resi resign. Uh, here's some of the responses she gave to those questions. Does Jamie Chalker have your confidence? So the police commissioner is on leave uh, and uh, Deputy Commissioner Michael Murphy is acting uh, and the police service have been advised of that. Do you understand that when you're asked the question Kathleen asked before about whether you have confidence in the police commissioner, when you say anything other than yes, the message to the community is that no, you don't have confidence in that police, police commissioner? If there's no other questions on other topics, I will uh, thank you for your time and, and conclude the press conference. Laura, I'm joined now by the opposition leader, Leah Finocchiaro. Uh, Leah, we were just hearing the Chief Minister there refusing to answer questions about whether the government has confidence in the police commissioner. Uh, what do you think needs to happen today? Well, I think this shows Natasha Files is running a circus, not a government. She needs to clarify immediately for the sake of our police force and the Territory on what his status is. We have a crime crisis plaguing the Territory and a police crisis, Matt, and for the government to pretend like something isn't going on here isn't good enough. Um, do you have confidence in the police commissioner? Do you think he should continue in his role? Well, what we've tried to do on six occasions is call an inquiry into the police crisis, and the very first thing that inquiry would have done is call Police Commissioner Jamie Chalker forward and ask him why he should keep his job. That clearly hasn't happened, so the question really sits with the Chief Minister around what is the status of our police commissioner and whether or not he's coming back. This needs to be cleared up as a matter of urgency. We've had reports at Sky News that there are between four and hundred, four and six hundred police officers calling in sick during any one pay period. It wasn't the government right to act to move Jamie Chalker on, given the morale crisis we're seeing within the Northern Territory Police. Well, we have several crises in our police force. One is around morale, attrition. We have 11% of our police leaving the force every single year. We know health and wellbeing is a major issue. And yet Natasha Files and her government are failing to tackle this issue head on. Now, if they have asked Jamie Chalker to leave as police commissioner, they need to own that decision and come for forwards, make sure the police force understand what that transition plan looks like and let the community know. But ultimately, burying their head in the sand is not creating confidence for our police or the community who want this crime crisis tackled head on. Well, Laura, a bit of a uh, crisis, as you can see, in the Northern Territory. Still no firm answer from the government at the moment, though, as to the future of Jamie Chalker. Matt, thanks so much.